Did you know that lower income households often spend a higher proportion of their income on visible luxury goods compared to their wealthier counterparts? This fascinating paradox, often observed in sociological studies, challenges our traditional understanding of luxury consumption. It begs the question, is luxury truly just for the poor? For years, luxury was synonymous with exclusivity, reserved for the elite few who could afford extravagant displays of wealth. Think sprawling mansions, opulent yachts, and dazzling diamonds. This perception, however, is being challenged by a changing economic landscape and evolving consumer behavior, particularly among those with less disposable income. For many in lower income brackets, luxury purchases are not merely about keeping up with the Joneses. They are about striving for a better life, a tangible symbol of aspiration and achievement. A designer handbag or a pair of limited edition sneakers can represent hope, a small piece of the dream they are working towards. They offer a sense of belonging, a way to participate in a culture that might otherwise feel inaccessible. However, this aspiration comes at a cost. Stretching beyond one's means to acquire luxury goods can lead to a cycle of debt and financial instability. The pressure to project an image of success can cloud judgment and prioritize short-term gratification over long-term financial well-being. In contrast to the conspicuous consumption often associated with lower income groups, the truly wealthy are shifting towards a more understated form of luxury. They are less concerned with flashy logos and ostentatious displays of wealth, opting instead for discreet brands, bespoke experiences, and investments in education, health, and personal growth. This shift can be attributed to a desire for authenticity and a rejection of materialistic values. The new elite are more interested in experiences and investments that enhance their lives, rather than possessions that merely project an image of success. They value knowledge, cultural capital, and social impact over material possessions. This trend is reflected in the rise of invisible luxury high-quality minimalist goods that prioritize craftsmanship and understated elegance over flashy branding. Think cashmere sweaters without logos, handcrafted leather goods, and bespoke travel experiences. For the affluent, luxury has transcended the material realm. It's about investing in experiences that enrich their lives and broaden their horizons. A private concert with a renowned musician, a bespoke travel itinerary curated by experts, or a philanthropic endeavor that aligns with their values. Education, healthcare, and personal growth have also become significant components of luxury spending for the wealthy. Investing in top-tier education for their children, prioritizing preventative health care and wellness programs, and pursuing personal passions are seen as essential investments in their well-being and future. This shift towards experiential and intangible luxury reflects a growing awareness of the limitations of material possessions. It's about seeking fulfillment and meaning beyond the fleeting gratification of a new purchase. The concept of luxury is fluid evolving beyond its traditional association with exorbitant price tags and exclusive access. It's about aligning spending with values, whether that means investing in experiences, prioritizing personal growth, or finding joy in simple pleasures. While the allure of visible markers of success might remain strong for some, true luxury lies in the freedom to define it on your own terms. It's about creating a life that feels rich and fulfilling, regardless of your income bracket. Ultimately, Luxury is not about the price tag, but the value we assign to it. It's about living a life that is authentic, meaningful, and reflective of our individual aspirations and priorities.